Okay, so setting up the RHH135 should be fairly simple. Um, assuming you've got the top part of the clutch sticking up through the bottom, uh, you should just put on the felt, put on the two nuts, And then just tighten them down, not too much, but enough to keep the symbol in place. Uh, then just take the top part, which is there, and screw that on. Screw that on until it stops, which in this case is when it touches the top nut, and then tighten that drum key bolt up there quite firmly. And there we go. And then you can tell if it's right, because if you turn this, you can hear it clicking. Um, and then I normally align the wing nut with the, uh, the, the stabilizer then. And the other thing to get right is that needs to be that way up, not that way. I go into so many stores and see that that way, which is not the right way. It's got to be that way up because that presses against the rubber part of the pad to do the closed. So you don't get the proper closing effect if that is not done. Then just put that through, push it down as far as you want, tighten it up, and that's it. Now, it does move a little bit. There's a little bit of movement there. You can tighten that up a little bit more if you want, but as long as you play fairly straight on uh, and not at an angle like that, it should be okay. Um, I don't have an issue personally. I know other people do, but having seen videos of them playing, it's normally because they're coming in at an angle um, and it's just pushing the cymbal around. That's going to happen, just as it would do on a real cymbal. But that is the basics of how you put it all together.